Hello. Welcome back to Vagrant Story. Last time we, um... Did what ended up being an unnecessary trip into the Iron Maiden. But we did get the chest key, and do I have more... Okay, I thought I might have another elixir. Alright, but we're going to go into here. Um, the first area that I had done... That required po the post game, <clears throat> the post game key, because even though we can't go back and forth through here without the silver key, there is a an iron key locked door in here, which should be an item. So let's see what that is. Oh! I did not notice that when I was in here before, I don't think. The first one is a Lich. This is a Lich Lord. <laughs> he is much worse. <laughs> Maybe I did point that out. I I think the regular Lich has death. I know the Lich Lord has death. And yes, that will one-shot you. Huh. I thought this was going to be an item room. Huh. Escapeway. Huh. I don't know that I want to actually be in here right now. This is another uh, post-game exclusive dungeon in a addition to the Iron Maiden. Uh, there should be bosses down here as well, but nothing like uh, the super boss in the Iron Maiden. <laughs> I, I genuinely don't think I want to be here right now. Um, hmm. I think it'll be okay. I just can't uh, do everything in here yet. I'm pretty sure everything other than the Iron Maiden that's post game is pretty short. Like the um, Snowfly Forest East. I don't think this will be just three rooms, but. There's also definitely some treasure rooms that I cannot get into. Neither. The silver or gold key will be found in here. That's for sure. They are part of the main game. But let's see what we can do in here. Um, th these are uh, not elementals. I mean, they are, but they aren't. <laughs> these are uh, like souped up in-game versions of them. Yeah, you do that. <laughs> I am not afraid, for uh, obvious reasons. But they are also resistant to chains. Every... Everything, for some reason, is resistant to chains in the endgame. I... I don't know. I don't know. It was a decision that Square made, and it was a wrong one. So just keep single shanking him until he stops moving. I actually have that maxed. Yeah, that was very fast. Zero. Wow. Okay. Okay. <laughs> gonna hit my head. If that's the way you want to play it. And he did not die. Okay, so why is my knife... I'm gonna switch weapons, but why is my knife so terrible on him?
Yep, that would be why. <laughs> it just has a lot of fire element. Yeah, you do that. All I gotta do is kinda poke him and he'll fall over dead. Yep. I also do not need that. So I guess this is, if you haven't already maxed these spells, here you go. But there's also, like, no point in the game at all that they give you the single target spells other than, um... Uh, which one even is it? Spirit Surge, the light one. Because there is no light elemental. I actually don't know that we fought him yet, either. Maybe we have? The, the regular water elemental? They heal off the, the slight wound to my arm. <laughs> Screw you, little girl. <laughs> wow. I think these might also be the second uh, version of these dolls. That is actually a pain if that chest is magic locked, because silence stays on until you leave the room. And quite obviously, I cannot cast the cure. Okay. It'll, it'll be, yeah, it's immediately cured when you leave runes, but it stays on forever while you're in the same room. Right. Magic. So of course, it doesn't work on bosses. There is nothing you would want to use debuffs or status effects on that'll actually work on them. That's not, that's not entirely true. Generate will work on some bosses. A silver great axe. I'm actually going to take that because I have not shown those off yet. I guess I haven't sorted after getting those. Oh, and magic points. Watch me only get one. Hey, four. That's, uh, that's, that's four. This is going to be quite terrible. I mean, it's good on Phantom and Undead. Do I have any break cards with it? I have to actually pull it out. I actually do. Interesting. I think I showed off the two-handed mace. It, this is this is pretty much identical to using that, honestly. I, I do not know why they made them two different things. They, they I mean, I do, because they're two different things, but they act, they act exactly the same. So, there'll be more to do down here once I get the silver and gold keys. Okay, I actually thought there was going to be a dark element in here. There is in a lot of stairways. Okay, I'm not messing around with this guy. I don't think I need the level 4 to kill him. He has four parts. Why? He is he is definitely not light. Okay. Is he just resistant to magic then? By explosion. No? 
Try exorcism. He is undead. No, Lich Lord. Yeah, he is a. Uh, he is being a pain right now. Sure. Oh, okay. Explosion is. No, explosion is is not an elemental. Huh. Why though? Why? This is the light AOE. Why though? A single target does damage. Okay, but seriously, I'm not messing around with him. That was, uh... That was annoying. I guess I could show the, uh, critical shield. Yeah, it, it, this is how, uh, Damascus stuff looks. I have nothing Damascus other than, uh... The mace... I guess these three. three. I have three things other that are Damascus. Yeah, if I had a Damascus hoplite shield, it would look just as, I guess, goldish. Okay, then. Now, we will switch to the two-handed axe. The great axe. I know there's a regular lich in here, but he's honestly not as scary. I wanted to back up so I could show you the swing. <laughs> okay. I was not expecting to crit him, but sure. Okay. So I actually want to be back in there, but actually, no, let's go to the, the Man of Mines too. But I do actually want to be in there, just a different part of the uh, dungeon that I can't reach without the silver key. That was fast. Ow! That was slow. I disagree. Right on. Except that's my paralysis cure. <laughs> I don't think that's actually going to kill him. Nope. Back here. You get to see a little bit more of the standard gameplay like this, I guess. showed him. Oh, I thought this was a sigil. Whatever. I also still have poison on me. That was pretty fast. I was not expecting that swing to be so fast. And now he's dead. Ooh. You can see I uh, killed his legs. 
for what that's worth. Thirty six risk. I think I may have mentioned before, but that also includes the effectiveness of heal. Okay, so this is where I got the Chris knife. Which I'm actually going to take if I find a... Uh, that would actually be a much better... <laughs> Great Axe. Um, pretty sure I have that already. I should already have that. Yes. Okay. Silver is actually pretty weak. Thirty seven attack. Okay, maybe not. Huh. Silver is typically pretty weak. It's usually better for magic. Odd. I don't know. Let's just get a look at this one and then I'm just going to pitch both of them. Yep. Just a little bit of weapon variety. Oh, that's just a blade, okay. So I guess I can show... I did show combining and whatnot before. I guess I can show that a little more. Let's actually just pitch these. I'm not overly concerned about them. Yeah, this is just a blade. Okay, so now where do I actually want to go? Go to the west? Yes, I want to go to the Sunless Way. Or the Crumbling Market. <laughs> Whichever one is actually closer. I saw another place that had more silver key doors when I was looking at the map before. Not silver key, iron key. There is a silver key door over here. And it's right next to a save point. So that's handy. East? Shouldn't be east. No, there's nothing in east. No, I guess that's it. Okay, so I think we're all cut up. No? No, there is a place in one of the walls that I have not been to, I think. Yep, for some reason I just did not continue from here. I think I want to do that. Maybe. Because I'm 99% sure that the place in the Undercity is, pro is progress. So that's City Walls East, uh, Town Center South. So back to here. Uh, so we need to go to the keep or the gate. Okay, the gate. Is, mm, the keep is technically closer. Eh, doesn't matter. This is same region. Okay, got my knife back. So you notice there's guys that always buff. They will always have those buff spells. They, It's never random. They always have it. I 
think checking a uh, workshop will tell me what it actually... No, I can't actually check it. So I can't actually see what any of the workshops work on. The guy outside used Prestasia this time. He also still does have Heracles. If you give him the chance to cast them, he will cast both of them. Yeah, take that. I suppose I could also be using Drain Mind on enemies to recover magic points instead of using a chain. But regardless, I still need an enemy to recover magic points. Hey, I got through without them being, uh, jerks. So I've mentioned these guys before. I think it was the last part, maybe the part before. Yeah, it took him that long to think to do anything. And it was a buff on himself. But if I want to ignore the ones that aren't just immediately coming at me, I can ignore them. I think they drop mana items, though, so... They can be pretty worth fighting. Really? And now they're too far apart. Okay. I should have just switched to four. Oh, that's right, it also cures numbness. Numbness is, um... Not too bad. It just makes you move slow. It's annoying, but it's not awful. was honestly expecting a Dark Elemental in here. <laughs> I have not fought one as a boss yet, and I know you do. I think this might actually be it. I f Game? Okay. That one. Yeah, this is the Dark Elemental. That, uh, that took a moment to load. Oh boy, this one again. I don't know why he's letting me chain him so much. remember fighting the wind elemental. I think he might be the only one left. One agility, sure. Town center east? Huh. I do not recall a locked door in town center east. Unlatched? Excuse me? Oh! I... Okay, no. I don't know why I'm saying that. I don't know where I'm at. <laughs> There's multiple areas that look like this. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'll close out of it. I don't want it. You know what? Let's try exorcism. I don't think I, I don't think I've gotten to show that off yet. 100% chance. Maybe I did show that off actually. <laughs> it just just that quickly. I actually might know where I'm at, kind of. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> kind, kind of, kind of. This could be where I get the silver key. Also, really fast to attack. It is uh, actually kind of hard to get them before they hit you. If I had my sword or mace equipped, I probably could have regular attacked him. So this one was facing the wrong way. Gold key. This goes further down. Yeah, take that. So I think this is exactly where I wanted to go. Maybe. I think the path um, to the left from here will take me back to here, I think. Because I do remember that being progress. Let's just go up this way, because this should go to the locked door. This might also not take me where I think it is. No, it does not. Okay. Good talk. So I do still need to go there. Got your arm. Got your arm. <laughs> and you regretted it. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay, see here, I kind of pointed this out before. Uh, with the with the um, the circle shield it was also highlighting Jim, so this sword is highlighting blade and grip. That means it's a full weapon. I think it also just, it just says down at the bottom that's a weapon that it's a weapon, and this is just a blade. It's just a yeah a blade, and this is just a grip, and so on. And the shield also has a gem in it. I should have to spell. Oh, which one would it be? Sorcerer, I think? Yes. Alright, I have to spell. Yeah, I I I should know. I ha I have these spells. Unless I get one of the sequel target spells, I have all the spells. Especially now that I have teleport. Which, despite this just being a few rooms away, <laughs> is probably going to take all of my magic points to reach. Well, not quite, but a bit. Okay, this this is why I... Okay, yeah. This, okay, and this is an exit in the area. Okay. Yeah, but this is why I thought I recognized where I was at. Because it's, it's literally the exact same room. Hmm. Limestone Quarry. Okay! We got, like, multiple sigils for this place. This is progress. We are almost at the end of the game. <laughs> I, uh, I was not expecting it to sneak, on, sneak up on me like this. Oh, I 
I got I got something for an undercity, didn't I? Well, not the silver key. Right, there's that one as well. Yeah, I got a, a sigil for the for an undercity, didn't I? Huh. Oh, Town Center East. That's what it was. And I, and I... Yeah. I needed both of these before I could come here. I don't know where I got both of them. I think one of them was on the Minotaur Zombie. Okay, so Town Center East. Oh, that's for the uh, workshop. Okay. I'm not going to worry about that, honestly. I'm fairly certain I come through the back end of the other locked door. I think. I could also just go to this workshop and then down here. I definitely do not want to go into Limestone Quarry yet. Alright, I am, once again, over time... <laughs> I'm going to go over here to this locked door and see how much it'll cost me to teleport to that um, that other workshop. Okay, this is why, because I expected this to be an item room. <laughs> Screw you, skeleton. And you, lich. That's what you get. on the chest. <laughs> City walls north? What? Was there a locked door in City Walls North? O okay, I guess there was. Back to Town Center East? Okay. Sure. Whatever keeps me away from going to the limestone quarry. <laughs> That's right, just walk away from him. Okay, which one was it? Do something. The jaw. I don't know how. I don't know how that's pronounced. There, are, there are so many. If you pay attention to the uh, the names of locations, there, there's some pretty um, out there ones. All right. Hopefully, I will, will remember that I'm going there next time. You know what? I am going to make a note while this is saving. Because this is going to take a long time to save. But yeah, that's going to be it for this part. We will see what's in there next time. But uh, that's going to be it for this part. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you stick around for more. And thanks for watching.